Hello everyone, in this scene I am offer horse from her co-worker that should you receive an exclusive contract offer with a fantastic payment. Nayang rushes to the chief director's room and finds Suji holding a pen, seemingly ready to sign the contract. Suji appears hesitant as the payment offer in the exclusive contract could greatly help her and her struggling family. Before Suji can make a decision to accept or reject the offer, Nayang leaves from outside the chief director's room. All Nayang knows is that Suji was holding the pen, leading her to believe that Suji signed the contract. That night, Nayang encounters Suji at the hospital and takes her to the emergency stairs. Nayang expresses her belief in Suji, thinking that Suji will help her this time. Suji tries to explain that Nayang misunderstood, but Nayang refuses to believe it, insisting that she saw Suji sign the contract with her own eyes. Nayang even goes as far as calling Suji as a derogatory name and question how Suji could sign the contract if she truly considered Nayang as her younger sister. Suji advises Nayang to check the facts before arguing with her. Suji, lacking the energy to confirm Nayang, decides to leave. As Suji descends the stairs, Nayang tightly holds her hand, causing Suji to fall. Fortunately, Uri arrives and saves Suji. Uri reprimands Nayang for her outrageous action towards Suji. Okay, everyone, that's the scene for this time, and thank you for watching my video.